Hello lovely people and welcome back to Accidental Adult. It is fantastic to see you here again and today I'm going to show you how to turn your normal shoes into laceless shoes. These are my shoes. I bought them in 2016. They are old and pretty beat. But I love them so much and I wear them all the time. The problem is they're not presentable because this ball right here is unacceptable. So I'm going to remove it using this. These are called the lace anchors and they basically turn your shoes into slip-ons and that's what I want. I don't want the bow, I don't want to hide the laces inside the shoes, I want them gone. So let's see how this works. I haven't untied these laces in like three years. It doesn't fit. And if the laces don't go through what do I do? I don't want to break it. Well, this can't be good. Okay, I'm gonna have to cut the laces, which is something that I don't want to do. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. So this better works. This better works because if it doesn't, I'm gonna be so upset that I had to cut. That I had to cut the aglet off because I wanted to test these before cutting them off completely. It's fine, it's fine. Put it. Bring the shoelaces inside the top eyelet. Fit it! Fit it! Ha 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 ha! I just I, I need to I need to check. Oh, so it's my shoes' fault. It's my shoes' fault because it's so fat. The laces are so fat. <sighs> okay, update. So, turns out I didn't need to cut the aglet. So, I basically cut this for no reason and spent an embarrassing amount of time trying to get it through two holes. And I could have just forced it. I was afraid of breaking it, this is why I didn't try it the first time, but yeah, we learn from our mistakes. See, it's not so bad right now. I don't think this is going to come undone. I don't think it's going to get loose because it's so hard to drag it through. I genuinely think that this is going to last forever, unless it breaks. After what seemed like an eternity, I was finally able to put the anchors on both shoes and to size them to the desired fit. I am going to loosely tie two bows and test the anchors before officially cutting the laces. I also managed to put the aglet back on the lace, which made me very happy. It's been almost three weeks since I put the anchors on my laces and I actually put them through the ultimate test. I wore them to many, many days of protests. Let me explain. There is a revolution going on in Lebanon right now and I was lucky enough to be a part of it. And what are you going to wear to a revolution other than your oldest pair? So since the anchors performed really well, I decided to go ahead and cut the laces. Okay. Oh my 
God, I'm freaking out right now. I'm just gonna hide just like this. I'm gonna twist it. No, I can feel that. I don't wanna feel, I don't want to be able to feel it. Okay, so I don't feel this side. So maybe if I tuck it underneath this, I wouldn't be able to feel it. Okay, that's fine. Wow, they look so good. And that is all I have for you today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit that like button if you did. Subscribe if you aren't already. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.